What's the trademark of a man who has a heart of gold? It's a genuine smile, a feeling that the person you're talking to cares about every word you're saying. That quality can be found easily if you ever visit Pensacola, Florida, home to a brother who's known for his constant hospitality. He never says a bad thing about anybody, and nobody ever says a bad word about him. He's just one of those guys that, that everybody likes. Ken Jernigan is nothing less than a perfect gentleman. Those who know him, and any brother who has participated in the SAE National Amateur Golf Tournament, are well aware of that fact. Ken is a familiar face that makes you feel like you're right at home, and he cares deeply about the company he keeps. I love him like a brother. I honor him as a fraternity brother. But his friendship is, is worth a lot. Ken grew up in the Florida Panhandle and decided to keep his roots there. Out of high school, he headed off to the University of West Florida, where he joined Sigma Alpha Epsilon. The men in the chapter have always known they could count on Ken, and he's proven his commitment to being a brother continuously since he graduated. In SAE terms, he's a true gentleman. He is a man that's um, loyal to his family, he's loyal to his friends, he's loyal to his church, and he's loyal to SAE. Once he finished school, Ken took a job in one of the hardest, most thankless professions in America. He taught science and biology at Escambia County High School. It would be an opportunity for him to work with young people. Though he moved on to another career, Ken continues to work with young men and women and has stayed actively engaged in the Greek letter community. He's now the owner of his own successful company, providing some of the most important recognition pieces to fraternities and sororities. And when he attends annual conferences and conventions, he serves as a goodwill ambassador for Sigma Alpha Epsilon. Actually, it would be hard to find a Greek letter leader who doesn't know him. Very loyal to, obviously to SAE and to whatever he's involved with. And I think all the things that he's been involved in in his past, of course, makes him what he is today. Perhaps Ken's greatest achievement for SAE, though, is his ability to bring brothers together once a year in Florida's western panhandle. And since Florida is often associated with golf, what better theme for an event? More than 30 years ago, Ken helped to create the SAE National Amateur Golf Tournament, and today it's going just as strong as ever. Many brothers come back year after year. It's like a homecoming or reunion, and that's how Ken intended it. Every tournament, golfers and their guests can expect to see Ken in the hospitality suite, greeting people with that genuine smile and handshake, asking them what they need. He will do anything for anybody. If, if he can help you do something, he will do it. Outside his fraternal life, Ken gives back to his community. For example, the famous Blue Angels relied on him for their recognition jewelry and enjoyed a special relationship with Ken. They liked him so much, they made him an honorary member in 1998. It's a distinction very few people get. 48 honorary members in all. Ken Jernigan, one of them. And his membership puts him alongside the likes of Bob Hope and Arnold Palmer. Have no doubt, though, Ken stays busy. His friends joke he's so busy he forgot to get married. But between spending time with the love of his life, or working at his business, or organizing an event in the name of SAE, Ken never thinks of his list of things to do as a chore. What I do is not a job, it's just fun. I mean, I don't watch the clock. Carol tell you, I'm on the computer, uh, you know, night and day and, and working. But He remains ever focused on his life and happiness, with the fraternity, with his self-made career, and with his family. Perhaps it's cliche in an organization like ours, but if SAE had to illustrate the real-life definition of the true gentleman, one of the first examples could easily be Ken Jernigan. He's everything that we demand of our fraternity and he's done it for years and years at his own sacrifice. At the end of the day, Ken knows being part of our brotherhood has paid him dividends he could never have imagined. Realizing through the good and the bad, he has a special bond for a lifetime. Well, I was the only child and I didn't have brothers and sisters. So now I have plenty of brothers and that's the biggest thing. And we count on each other, we're there for each other. Uh, it's been a wonderful life. It's been a very, a very nice experience for me. And that's why Sigma Alpha Epsilon presents its 125th Distinguished Service Award to Kenneth Elwin Jernigan 
from Florida Sigma at the University of West Florida.